सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन रीड द डिस्क्लेमर फर्स्ट सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल कंपेयर बोथ द रिजल्ट ऑफ कैलास्टिको विदाउट यू नो ए टी आर कंडीशन इन द एंट्री कंडीशन बिल्डर एंड विथ ए टी आर एज आई प्रोमिस्ड यू नो टू गिव यू गाइज यू नो कंपेरिजन रिजल्ट ऑफ बोथ द स्ट्रेटेजीज सो एज यू कैन सी ये वी हैव एडेड इन अवर शेड कोड डिप्लॉयमेंट ATR condition. So this is the PNL of uh, that strategy uh, of today. And uh, I also, you know, uh, deployed in another slot uh, the original strategy uh, without ATR condition. So <coughs> there it took one extra trade. As you can see, uh, as we have not added any ATR condition in this uh, original YouTube uploaded strategy of Kalashnikov. So there our PNL is luckily more. so it seems like <clears throat> adding atr based condition uh, might you know give you little uh, less risk but less reward also and uh, with uh, original condition you might get more risk and more reward so now it's up to you to choose between both of the versions uh, let's check once on chart today's trades so as we can see uh, first trade it took around 1110 uh, with original strategy without atr1 then third trade it took at around you know 235 pm uh, with original strategy and these both three trades are taken with atr condition strategy also as you can see see here it took this 1110 trade and uh, directly traded this 235 trade it skipped the in between trade of uh, this 42700 strike trade of one of five pm because it seems like here our atr condition didn't match our sl uh, was big it seems like at this stage so uh, we will check one by one all three so here at 1110 our put side trade conditions were satisfied so let's check that on chart so here our condition got satisfied at 1105 after uh, the candle broken all the three moving averages here so it might be our trigger candle and as you can see our rsi is also close below 40 rsi 7 close below 40 level at that time let's check what was the atr so as you can see atr was 49.63 you can check here at 1105 atr was 49.63 and uh, we are checking atr of previous 5 minute candle so uh, tradtron must have checked the 11 am atr uh, which was around 50.56 so let's calculate so our range is 116.28 so if our entry level and our sl level uh, comes below this range then our trade should have been taken so let's check the range you know this is our entry level and uh, highest high value means this is our sl level i guess So as you can see, the range is of 54 points only. So it comes under our ATR based entry condition. So it took the trade in both the scenario with ATR and without ATR version. Now let's check the another one uh, which got skipped with our ATR based condition. So it was uh, I think around 105 p.m. Okay, so due to this candle, uh, entry satisfied at 105 because previous candle crossed above. RSI 60 as you can see here here you can see RSI value here you can see ATR values and uh, here ATR was 41.75 so our range of entry and uh, this must be our SL point the lowest low value of both this candle must be our SL point let me you know zoom a little bit so lowest low value of both this candle is this so this must be our SL value and this is our entry level so let's check this range first so okay this is uh, approximately uh, 110.24 range and uh, our atr was at 41.75 so let's calculate that also 41.75 into 2.3 so equal to 96 so this range is bigger than our actual desired uh, you know range uh, if you would have selected atr range is uh, suppose um, ATR into three, so forty-one point seven five into three. 
instead of uh, I suggested mine suggested 2.3 uh, ATR into 2.3, then you would have taken this trade. So it all depends on you uh, what uh, multiplication you want to use uh, with ATR indicator. I randomly selected ATR into 2.3. You can you know uh, run this strategy on uh, paper trade and de then decide uh, for yourself after analyzing the performance of uh, the strategy for multiple days that what range is you know optimal uh, to use with ATR multiplier. So due to this reason, this trade was skipped with this ATR uh, based modified version. Even though it given profit of uh, forward 7k but you know uh, there our SL was very big so you have to keep that in mind and the third trade was common in between uh, 2.35 pm so let's check that at 2.35 pm so as you can see here RSI dip below level 60 and again crossed above level 60 so uh, at 2.35 our trade uh, satisfied because of this candle crossed above 360 so uh, it's obvious as you can see that our SL is very small of uh, only 46 points and at that time ATR was 44 points so no need to calculate uh, this was obvious uh, reason to take the trade because our SL was small so our risk reward is favorable here so I hope you guys uh, got the idea of uh, exact uh, things which I wanted to convey uh, to you guys I will keep this uh, deployment maybe for a few more days uh, after that I will you know need this slot so I will remove this uh, if someone have uh, any free slot available then I will try to deploy this original strategy in that slot and give a share code to you guys uh, so that's it I hope uh, this video was helpful to you so thank you see you in next video